Hey, what's up? My name is Reed Jaha. You're watching the Reed Jaha Show. Today, we're going to be talking about something real and what goes on in everyday life. And somebody on Facebook wanted me to talk about this. And I'm going to talk about it because I feel like I had it before. People have done it to me many a times without knowing me and stuff and accusing me of being a certain thing. And today, this segment is called Judgment. So, today, what I got to say, now, I'm going to tell you all about me first. All in my life, I've been judged as being gay, the G word, and I just don't appreciate it because I'm not, I'm not bisexual or anything, and I don't approve of it. I mean, I'm a boy, we have, some dudes have, like, look nice, pretty, and I'm, I'm a pretty boy, and, you know, swag and I think myself I think I'm really sexy for who I am I'm single I think most people with we're happy with judgment people take a person they can take a person from okay let me say this people some people take people some people tend to judge people because they can't look at their self in the mirror so they have to get up at somebody else, making somebody else feel bad. If a woman wants to be a lesbian, they could be a lesbian. If a guy wants to be gay, a guy can be gay. But don't try to accuse people of being something that they're not. Because you don't know them personally. If they wanted to be gay, or if they want to be a lesbian, that's their decision. Nobody can take that away from them. Nobody. And I feel like as this, I've been infused all my life because the way I walk, the way I talk, the way I dressed when I was younger. I recently changed my style up lately. I wear, now I wear, I don't, because I, I used to wear tight pants or whatever. But now I changed my style up and I wear dress pants now. And, you know, I feel like people tend to try to put people down and put pressure on people because they can't. Take a minute and look at themselves in the mirror before judging somebody else. And I just feel like that's not right. And a person should be equal. People are equal. If people want to get married, if people want to get married, if two dudes want to get married or two females want to get married, they should be able to get married. Nobody should put criticism against them because they want to be gay or if they want to be a lesbian. So... I really feel like when people come in from because in my life, some most of the time I cried when people would pick on me. My my own family picked on me. My own family called me gay high. Like when I'm the little cousin sometimes do it now and like when I was younger my cousin would call me we gay high, we gay high. And that stuff really made me feel down and I really felt sad about it and I wanted to cry and I never wanted to talk to some of those people again because I feel like we're family. If I was, you should take me for who I am and take me as I am. And I felt like it really hurt me to a certain extent when people make comments about people like that towards me because I had it all my life. I still get it today. Are you? People try to talk to me. Dudes try to talk to me. I don't let dudes talk to me. I mean, I want a girlfriend. I want I really do want a girlfriend. But I feel like every time I try to talk to one, I don't have game. And I feel like I don't have game. And I feel like that nobody, nobody wants me. And I feel like sometimes I feel like I was ugly. And I felt like trying. I'll try to be different. I try to do stuff that the other dudes was doing. I never sag because the true definition of sagging is that you're letting another man and you're letting okay sagging is you're letting another man another man check you out and look at you and giving them easy access that's where i found out what sagging the definition of saying was but i feel like this i don't do that i try to be different i'm unique i try to be different now it's not times where I've thought about it, like, when people tell me I should try it, but I was like, no. And I was like, to myself, sometimes I felt like, I was thinking, like, should I try it or no? But I was like, no, I can't see myself being with another boy, and I can't see no 
no sex, no sexual stuff happening. Hell no. But I mean, people are people have their own opinions about a person, and people can say what they want. People tend to hurt people, but you know, you just gotta give back up and not care what people think about you, and just keep doing what you do. Make your money. Do what you gotta do. Get a career. Get a life. Get a diploma. Get a degree. You know, get financial success. Build your credit. Do everything. Be the best person that you can be in life without people judging you and stuff like that. Always make sure, and no matter what, don't ever care what next person is thinking about you or saying about you because the long the the more you tend to care about what people think about you, the more you're letting it you're allowing it in your life and you're allowing it to affect you and maybe hurt you and stuff like that. But in life. People are going to judge you for who you are. People are going to make assumptions of your sexuality. And people are going to think stuff about you. And you just got to walk away and just dust it off and not care what people think. You know what you are. And you take yourself for who you are. Your family should take you for who you are. Your friends should take you for who you are. And you should be allowed to be free. And just live life and just enjoy yourself. And just have fun and just not care what people think. And just do what you love and just do what you feel and do what you put your mind to. And not care what people think or don't. Just don't care about how people judge you. People judge, you, people judge each other every day. And the thing about it is that I don't understand how people call me gay or whatever. Because I'm not, it's not like I'm a boy and I'm making twerk videos. And I'm not, I see other, it's like, it's dudes on Facebook that's making like twerk videos and stuff like that. And dudes on Facebook making statuses, playing with each other, talking about each other, talking about fucking each other. And they're posting straight, but really not. And I'm not going to put no names out there, but it's the truth. And I tend not to put the feed into it. But, I mean, it's not like I'm a person that's doing that. I mean, yes, I am different. I am a pretty boy. Yes, I am different. Maybe I do do stuff a little different, but you just got to take me for who I am and take me for as I am. And you just got to let people have their own opinions. People are going to talk about you every day for the rest of your life until you die, until you're dead and gone. People are going to talk about you and you just got to let it move. You just got to dust your shoulders off at the end of the day because every day is a brand new day. And... Every day you learn something new, and every day you are brand new. And every day when you look into that mirror, you tell yourself, "I am beautiful, no matter who you are, no matter no matter what. You are beautiful." When you look in that mirror, and people try to make you tend to fall down, and most make you feel down, and don't let. People have you make you have suicidal thoughts and stuff like that. You know, build yourself up. If you need somebody to talk to, make sure be friends, befriend people. You know, talk to your friends, talk to your family. If you feel like it's nobody you could talk to, go see a counselor, counselor, or go see a therapist. Stuff like that. Don't let negativity get to you. Don't let Saddam get to you and don't let people get the best of you you know you have to be you just be you do what you do keep on doing what you do and just not care what people think because people are going to have opinions people are just going to do what they want to do make fun of you and try to get something out of you and you can't feed into stuff like that don't go killing people don't go trying to kill yourself. Don't go crazy. Just be you. Do what you do. And try to build, try to be better than people. And just try to make something better for yourself. You know, go to college. You know, get a better job. Get a degree. Get a diploma. Most people don't have a diploma. Most people don't have a degree. And most people don't have a job. And people tend to be jealous of people, but you just got to let people think and just say what they want to say because you're going to be successful one day. If you put your mind to it, you can change yourself. If you put your mind to it, 
And if you need somebody to talk to about any advice, I'm right here. My name is Reed Jaha Owens. I'm from the Reed Jaha Show. You can talk to me about anything. Send me an email at reedjaha at yahoo.com. If you need anybody to talk to, when you have nobody else to talk to, you can add me on Twitter, Facebook, whatever. You can talk to me. And I'm here. So that's all I got to say. This is my video about judgment. Don't care what people say about you. Let people say what they want and let people say what they feel. Because no matter what, you have to be strong. Because one of me is wiser, one of me is stronger, and one of me is a fighter. You have to be the fighter and you just have to let them know, I am an army of me. Let them know. But I'm going to end this video right here. Thank you for everybody who's watching. Make sure you guys share this video. Not in a funny way, but in a serious way. Make sure you share this video. And make sure you like my Facebook. <laughs> make sure you like my Twitter, my Lujah Show. Make sure you subscribe to Lujah Show, that's what I'm trying to say. And just make sure you follow me. So, 